All right, good afternoon, everybody. Dashing Dink coming at you with another day of DoorDash. <laughs> and there's our first order. Incoming message. All right, so no more peak pay. We're doing a continuation. It's now the afternoon or lunch shift. And we just got an 8.50 to go 7.1 miles. And... I'm gonna take it because it's all highway. It's from Applebee's. You guys haven't been to Applebee's with me yet. We're gonna hang out for a little bit. I'm gonna finish my intro because Applebee's can take some time, but I'm gonna take it just because it's highway. Uh, we did breakfast shift earlier. There was a peak pay from 7.30 to 11.30 of $3 per, per order. Now, this afternoon, they just added another peak pay. It's going to go from 1 p.m. until 4 p.m. this afternoon for $2.50 per order. So, we've got about an hour and a half over lunch here that there's no peak pay, but then they're going to put another one on. So, people must drop off at around 1 o'clock. <laughs> All right, well, let's get back to this order. And we'll head on over to Applebee's and we'll get this one picked up. Thanks for riding with me today. I have Erica, yes. Thank you. And the drink. All right, appreciate it. Is there a straw in the bag? Yes. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Have a great day. Thanks, you too. All right, we've got the order picked up for Erica from Applebee's. We're gonna just buzz out here real quick to the highway. And this shouldn't take, it says 10 minutes, but it's gonna take us a little less than that because we're gonna hit the highway and cruise around town via the bypass. So let's get this order over to Erica. Order for Erica? All right. How are you today? Good, how are you? Doing well. All right, got some Applebee's. Thank you. You're welcome, enjoy. Have a great day. All right, we got that order dropped off for Erica at Christensen Construction. All right, we are kind of in the downtown area. And we just got an offer. It was $4.04 to go four miles from Duncan. Um, I know the place that this is going, and it's a very long four miles. So I declined it. Buck a mile, yes, but I'm pretty sure we can do better. All right, I'm glad we declined that one because we just got a much better offer. 625 plus to go like 2.3 miles or 2.1 miles, something like that. And it's from Country Kitchen. <laughs> Excuse me. Right here? Nope, I do not. Thank you. We got the order picked up for Julie and we are going 1.5 miles. All right, Julie, thank you so much for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your country kitchen and have a wonderful day. 
All right, we got that order dropped off for Julie. And we immediately got an offer, it was a shopping offer from Dollar General for $8.21 to go incoming message. six point some miles and nine items. I declined that one, but now we just got an $8 plus to go 3.1 miles from Mi Rancho. So we're gonna go ahead and accept that one. <laughs> and Mi Rancho is just down the road. Incoming message. And, oh, what is this now? And it says that the order is ready to go. Well, let's head over to Mi Rancho, pick this order up. Thank you. There you go. I appreciate it. You have a nice day. Thank you. All right, so we finally got the order for Kylie. It sent us a message saying that Kylie's order was ready. So apparently somebody in there is hitting the order ready button before it's actually ready. <laughs> but we, I kept it because it's an eight plus. <clears throat> it's not going very far. I think it's going to the hotel right over here by the um, airport. So we'll be able to zip on over there pretty quick if people would start driving the speed limit in front of me thank you <laughs> all right let's head on over there we'll get this order dropped off and see what the plus is hello Hi. is this for you no oh this okay MZ. kylie kylie oh, okay <laughs> all right thank you you guys have a wonderful day. I'll do my best. All right, we got the order dropped off for Kylie, and the eight plus turned into nine fifty. Okay, so right when we got into the zone, we received a high pay offer, almost two bucks a mile, like really, really close. Five dollars to go two point six miles from Burger King. And when we get to Burger King and pick this up, we're probably going like 1.6 miles. John. Okay, thank you. We got the uh, order picked up for John, and I'm pretty sure this is going to the assisted living facility over off of Delton. And they want me to go out onto the main road, but because it's lunch traffic right now, I'm going to take the back roads. Hello. <laughs> this is for John P. John, your lunch is here in the front office. John, your lunch is here. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Have a great day. All right, the one thing I didn't get to tell you guys, uh, by the way, we just got John's order dropped off, and we received another order, which is 675 plus to go like 2.3 or 2.5 miles from Taco Bell. So we're going to head to Taco Bell 
But what I forgot to tell you is that we had that 625 plus um, order earlier from, I believe it was Country Kitchen. It went up to 650. So thank you to the customer for the very nice tip. And thank you DoorDash for hiding a whole quarter from me. <laughs> All right guys, DoorDash, DoorDash just tried to send me a stack for $2 to go an additional 0.4 miles, which I mean, granted, yeah, it's two bucks a mile basically, but I declined it. It's from Pizza Hut, which is right next door, but I declined it. I'm like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not taking that. Um, so we got the Taco Bell, but while we were in there, <clears throat> excuse me, they threw me a, another stack, which was a little bit better. But the only reason I took it is because it's going to the same customer. However, it's shopping for, I think it was 13 items at Dollar General for $9.27. But I text the customer and asked if he would like the food first because, <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't you want the food, right? Um, I don't want it to get cold while we're shopping. So we're gonna go drop the food off at this place of business and then we're gonna jump over to Dollar General, pick up their items and drop those off. All right guys, we just dropped off the Taco Bell. I didn't record it because Christopher was waiting for me outside of the furniture store so we're gonna head over to Dollar General now and get his items from there and then we'll come back and hopefully this time we can bring them in so you guys can check out the furniture store I just wanted to say very quickly too just so everyone knows it just rolled over one o'clock so neither one of these orders had the peak pay on it but now we are in a two dollar and fifty cent per delivery peak pay Good. That's good. Where you at? Oh, there you are. <laughs> good, man. Good. I couldn't see you. All I heard was a voice. <laughs> All right. We need eight ounce Cheetos Plus or Puffs, not Plus. <laughs> All right. We need two of those. Bam. Zero sugar Coke. Uh, scan. All right, we need one, two, and three. Got it. So we've got All right, one, two. And three. Captain, Captain. Whoa. Incoming, mes incoming message. New delivery. Plus 950. All right, I'm doing it. Oh, they only have one. Oh no, oh no. They only have one. So. Boom, 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 boom. They only have one. Oh, there we go, a $6 one, I bet. Um, 5.1? 5.1. Hey, hey, we're in business. Come on. Well, you got Incorrect item. What? Oh, right there, what's that with the dog on it? Whitman. There we go, I bet you that's it. 5.1 ounce. All right, let's try that one, scan again. Come on. 
Bingo. All right. <laughs> I'll be up in a little bit, man. Thanks. And it's an additional three. So scan. All right, one, two, and three. This is the correct item. All right, so we need two of those. Oreo Mega Stuff. Scan. Oops. Ooh, don't drop that. <laughs> Scan successful. Thanks, Sweet. Man. You bet. All right, guys. Um, we just dropped off Christopher's order, and it was nine dollars and twenty-seven cents. But he gave us an extra five bucks, so that went to fourteen twenty-seven, and now we're gonna go deliver the other one for an additional nine dollars and some change. So that's awesome. Some days I love my job with DoorDash. All right. Thank you customers so much for your order. I appreciate it. Enjoy your Dollar General items and have a wonderful day. Captain, All right, guys. <laughs> oh, my phone is just going off. Okay, so we got both those orders dropped off, and uh, it was like 20, 23 bucks, 24 bucks. And when I dropped this one off, we received. Now, you guys are going to get all over me. I know. And I apologize, but it was for $19.54. It was to shop for 25 items at Aldi and go get a pickup from Duncan, going to the same customer. It's just not quite rich enough for 25 items and a pickup from Duncan. If it would have just been the 25 items, I would have done it. So I declined the 1954, but now I just got an 807 for 3.7 miles or something like that. And it's for three, let me see. It's for four items from Dollar General. Uh, we need the scoops, here they are. All right, two of those. Right there they are, honey mustard. And two of those. All right. All right, guys, that was a very easy uh, shopping order. Two bags of chips, two bags of pretzels, and we're going 0.4 miles. So we'll head over there now. We'll get it dropped off. Then we'll see what else DoorDash gives us. All right, Gerald, thank you so much for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your chips and stuff. Have a wonderful day. All right, well, we got another shopping order, but I am prioritized for DoorDash shopping orders. I just want you guys to know that. So I, I get a lot of shopping orders offered to me through DoorDash because I am prioritized. Um, it is for $10.18 and it was to go five point four miles I think and it's for three items at Dollar General we're going back to the one on Division Street
this under me or you? All right, that was another quick, easy uh, shopping order. I, sorry I didn't talk much. I was just trying to get through it real quick. They did add one item. So we got two ice cream items, a bag of chips, and some dip. We're going 3.6 miles. So for 10 bucks, I like it. All right, thank you so much, Karen, for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your Dollar General and have a wonderful day. All right, so we just dropped off Karen's Dollar General order for $10 and I don't even know what it was, 41 cents or something. Then we got another shopping order from Dollar General. It was only for three items. It was $6 and I think 26 cents, but it was to go 6.1 miles. Buck a mile, wasn't very many items, but I declined it. We're just all over the board. I, we, we got up to 97% and now we're down to 91%, I believe. <laughs> so we've declined a few orders today. We've accepted a lot of orders today, but we're still in the 90s. No worries. And we still have red hot zones and it's 2.19 in the afternoon. So who'd have thunk? Here's another one. 8.53 to go 7.4 mi miles, um, six items from Aldi. I'll take a screenshot of it, but I'm not taking that one either. All right, everyone, that is gonna do it for today. <laughs> I got back to the mall parking lot, our favorite place to park, and I waited until the 10 minute cycle was through for the hot spots and then it went to previously busy hot spots. So I didn't want to sit around and wait. I know you guys are going to get after me because I quit during a $2.50 peak pay, but that's okay. We had a good day today. We got a lot of orders. I got a lot of content. I'm going to stretch it out over two days. And I'm really, really happy that we were able to finally, I was finally able to give you guys a good day of dashing in Bemidji, Minnesota. So very quickly, we'll go over some numbers. On the day total, we did like $163 and some change. I wanna thank you guys again for riding along with me for subscribing to the channel, liking the videos, watching the videos, uh, sharing the videos, um, and of course commenting. I love hearing the comments. But anyway, you guys, thanks again. I appreciate it. And this is Dashing Dink saying, until the next dash.